Singapore is taming its red-hot property market to give priority to locals wanting to buy their first homes. The additional buyer's stamp duty, or ABSD, was raised overnight. Foreigners are bearing the brunt with a doubling in their home purchase taxes. Now, the move has surprised even property analysts here in Singapore, who are now bracing for a possible steep drop in home prices. Rebecca Mateo with more. Living with luxury in this three-bedder condo in Orchard comes with an 8 million Singapore dollar price tag. Foreign buyers have been snapping expensive properties like Park Nova, mostly for investments in similar prime areas. They now account for more than a tenth of private homes in the city centre. For this segment of properties that the foreigners tend to consider, they are about $4,000 per square foot, $5,000 per square foot. They are used to such um, such uh, per square foot prices because they are really going for that ultra lux uh, properties. But recent property cooling measures are already putting a chill on the market. At least one Asian is being flooded with text messages from foreign buyers getting cold feet. For some of the clients that I'm currently uh, bringing around, they they do, they do. Uh, how do you say? Uh, postpone. They, they they have decided to postpone their purchase decisions. ABSD is a form of property tax levied on home buyers, both local and foreign. It doesn't apply to Singaporeans getting their first property. But for a second property, they must fork out 20% of property taxes, or 3% more before the revision. A third property will add 30% in taxes. Still, foreign buyers are the most affected. They now pay 60% of stamped duties for any purchase, double the previous 30%. The government says targeting this group is what it calls a preemptive move amid rapidly rising investment interests in Singapore's property market. It should take away some pressure on locals wanting to buy a home to live in. We prioritise at this time uh, Singaporeans who are buying for owner occupation. Um, so, so we will keep a very close eye on the property uh, market, especially in light of uh, global macroeconomic conditions and the interest rate environment uh, and make such other measures as might be necessary uh, to accommodate the changes in the environment. Mr Lee also says this demand is unlikely to move the rental market since housing supply will increase. We anticipate some 40,000 housing completions, about half uh, HDB, about the other half would be private residential. And these will add supply uh, to the rental market, either in the form of rooms or in the form of uh, whole unit rentals for private residential property. But some market watchers think this impact is likely to be muted. The number of homes that will be bought for rental income may start to reduce as well in the long term. When demand catches up with uh, supply, then uh, rental prices may continue to rise. There will be another group of demand where many of these foreigners, uh, because they are affected by the increased ABSD, they may uh, stop buying properties here, so they may turn to the rental market as well. The recent home stamped duty increases are the steepest yet. Previous rounds were between 5 and 10%. Analysts are not expecting further moves on this over the coming months.